Alrighty, everybody. Way to start off this week's vlog with two 2K eggs right away, and then we're gonna go ahead and walk for two more 5K eggs. Uh, we got a zoo bat on the first one. What I'm really going for is a Squirtle. I no longer need a uh, Bulbasaur or a Charmander. In fact, we're actually about to evolve uh, into a Charizard and an Ivysaur today. And uh, that is going to be very shortly. And Squirtle would have been great, but we got a Caterpie as well as a Zubat. And we do not need those at all. So we're going to go ahead and get rid of them. And I'm going to go ahead and catch you guys in just a little bit. And we're going to go ahead and start evolving right off the bat. Alrighty, everybody. This is going to be a special vlog because we are finally cracking down on the Pokédex in Pokémon Go. And I just ran here because I couldn't wait any longer. As you guys can see, my buddy is Charmander. Together, we've walked 21.1 kilometers total. Just finished my seventh candy by just walking with my Charmander. As you guys can tell, I cannot breathe at the moment. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, get some evolving in. Uh, I'm just gonna be right away into the vlog. And what we're gonna be getting are Ivysaur, Charizard, Raichu, and Dugong. And we're gonna go ahead and start off with the weakest link first, or the one that I really don't care too much about, and it is the seal. We're gonna save my Charizard for last because I cannot wait to get that. Of course, it's going to be my buddy eventually in this game. But for right now, I'm going to be changing my Charmander buddy, not into a Charizard, but into something that I really need to get candies into. And that is my Magikarp. I really want to get a Gyarados soon. And after these four evolutions, uh, besides getting Venusaur and Blastoise, I don't think there's many more that are going to be coming anytime soon. So for now, it's, this is pretty much it. Uh, the, this episode and the last episode have been a lot within the evolution chain. We got a really bad dugong, by the way. Uh, let's go ahead and level up or evolve my Pikachu into a Raichu real quick. And that is another one that I've been w waiting for and looking forward to. And it is a pretty decent enough Pikachu. Uh, the CP is at 520, I believe. So it should be a pretty decent enough Raichu. And I can't wait because Raichu's one, it, it, it's, it's up there. I, I, I love the form, uh, the Alolan form kind of weird, but I really love this one and I really love Raichu and I got the hang of Raichu mainly because of Lieutenant Surge. I really truly endured uh, Lieutenant Surge Raichu. It was very cute and I don't know, I just like it much more compared to Pikachu. So we finally got that as well. That is two evolutions out of the way. Let's go ahead and evolve the CP679, which is really, really high up there on the Bulbasaur scale, into an Ivysaur. And then last but not least, we're gonna finally get my favorite Pokemon in the game of Pokemon itself. Out of every single generation, uh, I've loved the OG of uh, Charizard since day one, so I cannot wait. Why is it froze? What the hell? What happened to my Pokédex? Why didn't you get added to Pokédex, bro? Oh well. I mean, I, I don't. I got. I got. A, I got a 1K CP Ivysaur here, son. Yes, I can go ahead and get Venusaur, but as you guys know, kind of OCD like that. I like to get the Pokémon into my. I, I want before I evolve my Ivysaur. I need to get another one. As you guys can see with my Charmeleon here. I uh, have another Charmeleon, I got it earlier today, and we are definitely going to be evolving this 934 Charmeleon into a Charizard. I cannot wait. This is my very first end of the line evolution chain for the starters. This is my very first one, and of course it has to be none other than Charizard. You guys don't even know how happy I am. We finally got Charizard here, son. Look at this. This is next level. Get added to the Pokédex, my man, because you are going nowhere. And it should be definitely high up there on the CPs. 1611 Charizard with the abilities of Wing Attack and Flamethrower. So he is a little bit... He is a little bit different. So let's go ahead and... Uh, I mean, what I mean by different is he's Flying and Fire type. So he is XL. I want to go ahead and appraise this bad boy here. See how good this one is. May not be great in battle, of course, of course. Defense is strong as fear, indicate it'll get the job done. It's gigantic, that's about it. So he's just a big Charizard, a big, fat, fluffy Charizard here. So we finally got Charizard, and that is 140 different Pokemon 
140. Oh, minus 7. That is 133 different Pokemon that we now have out of the 142 that we can get. And also, of course, as you guys know, I've got to now exchange my buddy of Charmander into Magikarp. And I believe that's probably about it that we're going to do for now until we can get these eggs hatched. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and make sure I've got all my Pokemon. I'm going to check the Pokedex in a bit while I'm walking. Uh, keep you guys updated. Again, Magikarp is now going to be my buddy. And how long does it take to get one egg from Magikarp? Sadly, Magikarp's my buddy, but I mean, it looks so bad. So every kilometer you get an, a candy, which is pretty decent. So I need to walk 200 kilometers to get this Magikarp to evolve into a Gyarados. So that's definitely going to be a feat of strength on its own. But I'll catch you guys in a bit. I, I can't believe Magikarp's my buddy, but I definitely can't believe we just got Charizard. So let's go ahead and walk our KMs to get this hatch. So we made it over here to my Pokey stop that is close by to my house. As you guys can see, Team Valor holding it up. They're both level four gyms with four Pokemon in them, so I'm not gonna be doing too much here. Uh, but let's go ahead and capture an Ekans. Hooray, I've already caught two on the way here. That is very cool. Very, very cool. As you guys know, the sarcastic is for reals right now. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so I don't really need any Pokemon anymore. Uh, the ones that are kind of in my area. Unless they're super rare. But I don't really need an Ekans unless the only reason why I capture them is if they're high CP. I'll evolve it into another Arbok. But this guy is kind of low, so he's kind of useless to me. But let's go ahead and check out... Well, I'll take the Eevee. That's pretty much it. Um, but let's go ahead and grab this Pokestop. Head on in to the other community here. And then head on back home. We are going to try to hatch these 5k eggs uh, before we get home. Uh, hurry up. I should be by this Pokestop by now. Should be by this Pokestop by now. And 3, 2, 1, 0. Give me an egg, please. 10k egg. 10k egg. I got an egg. That is, that is one way to start. And it is a 5k. So definitely not going to be putting that in an incubator anytime soon. Just got a magic carp candy from walking one kilometer. And I'll catch you guys in a bit. Now to end it off. I was able to push it. In fact, I am pretty much just at my house. Just behind me. We got a bell sprout on the first egg. We do need Licky Tongue of Porygon. And that is pretty much it. Bell sprout's okay candy wise. But it's just not something that I need at the moment. I just need... Porygon or Licky Tongue. And we got a Drowsy, which we don't see. Actually, we do see a lot of them now at the park, which I haven't been to in a couple of days. That's pretty much it. But uh, we didn't get too much out of those eggs, but that's okay. Stay tuned for some more. We got tons of evolving that we just completed. And uh, hopefully we can get a couple more in in this episode. And we are very close to hitting that 142 mark. We are at 133, so nine more to go. And those nine are... Lapras, Licky Tongue, and Porygon, Gyarados, Wartortle, Blastoise, Venusaur, Dra Dragonair, and Dragonite. That's pretty much it. We're almost there. So stay tuned. Thank you very much for tuning in, and catch you guys in a bit. What's up, everybody? For the Winitachi here, and yes, it is Saturday night. What does that mean? Well, as you guys know, my Pokemon Go Pokevlogs get released on Wednesdays and Saturdays. Uh, it is nighttime, so it is very hard to see me right now. But again, my Poke Vlogs get released Wednesdays and Saturdays. It is Saturday night. This is the day, supposedly, that this vlog is going to be released. I've got a lot of editing to do after this video, or after I create these next couple clips. And the reason being, the reason why I waited so long before I started editing to release this video, it is going to get released on Saturday, or today I should say, the day it's going to get released. Whatever the hell I'm trying to say, guys. But you guys get it. And the reason why... I decided to wait for so long is because I've been taking the grind to a whole new level and uh, I've been trying to utilize my time as much as possible so I can start ending this very first season of our Poke Vlog series. And uh, what I mean by that is I've got a couple more evolutions that I can do today. 
and uh, we're gonna go ahead and do them at the end of the vlog. Uh, we're gonna probably end the vlog with that. And those evolutions are Ivysaur, so we're finally gonna get a Venusaur. Uh, we're finally gonna get a War Turtle from a Squirtle, and I believe that is about it. I got two new evolutions that I'm gonna do today, and pretty much all that I'm missing are non-evolution Pokemon, and what I mean by that is Farfetch, Kangaskhan, Mr. Mime, but I can't get those, so I'm not gonna count them. Uh, missing the legendaries, Mew, Mewtwo, Articuno, Zapdos, and Moltres. Can't get those either. Ditto, I cannot get it. I am missing Porygon. The ones that I can get are Porygon, uh, Lickitung, Lapras, and uh, I believe that is it. I believe that's all I'm missing. And um, yes, Porygon, Lickitung, and Lapras. And then the Evolutions that I'm missing are Magikarp into Gyarados, as well as my Dratini into Dragonair and Dragonite. So I'm missing a couple evolutions, which is Magikarp and Dratini evolution chain, but I really cannot find those at all where I am located. Uh, so we're going to wait a little bit on them. I'm trying to utilize this light as much as possible. But yes, we got two new evolutions that we're going to end this vlog with, and that is going to be a brand new War Turtle and a Venusaur. Uh, we got some eggs that I would like to hatch, but I'm not too sure if we're going to get the 5Ks done, but we'll definitely get this 2K done. And I'm going to go ahead and just walk around and get that Pokestop down there, see if I can replace this 2K egg as soon as possible. But as you guys know, I always try to catch everything that I see. The reason being, the higher the CP and uh, hopefully a good IV set and a good move set, we will definitely be able to replay some of my current evolutions that aren't so maxed out yet. But without further ado, we're going to continue with this vlog and I'll catch you guys in a bit. Alrighty everybody, we about to do it. We about to get the evolutions in. As you guys can see back there, I just took the Pokestop. I'm basically going to walk a little bit more. Uh, we got about 0.2 kilometers to go to hatch our 2k egg. And what would be great to get out of the 2k egg is simply a Squirtle. If I can get another Squirtle with enough candies, I'm going to get a Blastoise today. I, I have enough candies to get a Blastoise today. I'm debating on whether I should just do it or not and then get a war turtle on my own time or wait until I get my war turtle and just evolve it in a later date. I'm debating on it but I'm not too sure yet. So we're going to get our 2K, 0.2k walk in and uh, we're going to go ahead right now and evolve our Squirtle and our Ivysaur into a Venusaur, our Squirtle into a war turtle. I'm going to start with the Squirtle because it is really really good as well as our Ivysaur as well. Um, we're finally almost there. We should be, after I evolve these two, we will be at 135 Pokemon out of 142. Something just appeared in the background uh, as I just got a vibration. I'm not too sure what it is, but that looks absolutely cool. I really, really am a true fan of the Squirtle Evolution chain, uh, especially War Turtle and Blastoise. They look absolutely boss. I love the Hydro Pump effect from um, Blastoise. Super cool. So 1,008, not as high as the other one. What was that that was nearby? It was a Pidgey. So we're going to go ahead. I do not have a Lucky Egg on. I'm just not doing that right now. Um, we're going to go ahead and evolve our 1057 Ivysaur into a real, real top-notch, top-quality Venusaur. So let's go ahead and do that as well. And uh, basically what's going on here is we have now 135 Pokemon out of 142. We are missing seven Pokemon. Those seven are Single Evolution Lapras, um, Porygon, Lickitung. We are missing Blastoise as well as Dragonair, Dragonite, and Gyarados. So a couple evolutions. Wow. Dude, Venusaur looking mean as. And I don't see that many of these. And it's only 1705 CP. Not that high at all. I'm going to go ahead and praise it to see what it is. Decent Pokemon. Very, very similar to... Actually, I think it's identical to my Charizard. Identical to my Charizard. And he's fat as. He is fat. So, we've got Venusaur. We've got Charizard. We have 135 Pokemon. Subtract 144 by 9. That's 135 unique Pokemon in our Pokedex right now. We are missing 7 more. Um, one of them I can get very soon, which is going to be Blastoise. The other 6 are going to be kind of hard to get. Lapras, not too much because I have a lot of 10k eggs. But as you guys know, I'm trying to make a 9 out of 9 10k egg video. So I'll eventually get that in as soon as possible. But uh, let's go ahead and see what our KM range. It should be hatching very very shortly very soon here actually let me go ahead and check it out real quick two out of two 
on this 2k egg. Uh, we're not going to hatch any of the 5k eggs today because I'm going to go home. Uh, but 1.99, we did get what I wanted to get done today. And that's pretty much leave it to the single evolution chains besides Magikarp and Dratini. And the reason why I'm holding off on those, well I'm not holding off, I'm just, I can't find them. I just don't know what I can do in order to find those. And I'm also going to wait after, I'm trying to hatch the egg here. And the reason being is I would like to get that Pokestop in one more time to see if I can get another egg on the way out. So, once this egg decides to appear... We will get back to it. Here we go. Egg, it really did not take that much effort. It just kind of had to move my avatar a little bit more on the map. And we got a Caterpie. I've been debating on it. And, uh... I've been debating on it. And... I, I got a Magikarp candy. I, I have Magikarp as a buddy, and you guys know why. I've been debating it. A 1008 War Turtle. I'm really not going to get anything higher than this. And it is an XL. If it's a good Pokemon, we will... It's decent, but I want to know what the... It's okay. I, I'm... It's okay. It can... It can change in evolution, and I really want to complete this Pokedex. So I will get another War Turtle on my own time. But now we are at 100... Oh my god. I can't. I can't keep my eyes off of this screen, dude. This is... I'm, I'm very shocked at evolution chaining. And again, what's helping me a ton is hatching eggs. Look at that, dude. If only he could hide your pump right now. If only he could hide your pump. Me in the face. I would love it. You guys don't even know right now. 1660 XL. Oh my gosh, please. Be a little bit different. It's okay, so it keeps the same. It's wow, It's got great stats and it's freaking large, dude. That is... Flash Cannon. Wait. It, it, knows, it doesn't know Hydro Pump. They can't know Hydro Pump. It knows Wider Gun and Flash Cannon. Steel type. That's a weird. That's a weird move set. I don't know about that. It's a, it's a, I don't think that's a good move set at all. But I can't complain. We now look at our Pokedex. Have 136 unique Pokemon. Oh my gosh. Oh. Dude, looking at this, I feel so freaking accomplished, dude. It is, there's, there's no spaces, there's no blanks, there's no, no way. There's, okay, Farfetch'd, I can't get it. I know Farfetch'd is 83. Um, 108, 115, 122, 130, we are almost done. The only evolution chains we have left are Magikarp and Dratini. The rest are going to come from eggs, and that is going to be Lapras, Lickitung, and Porygon. Uh, the others I can't get. Uh, Mr. My, I'm thinking of... I, I got something special on the next vi episode coming out Wednesday, so stay tuned for that. I'm not going to go ahead and uh, spoil secrets right now, um, but stay tuned for that. Let's go ahead and grab this Pokestop, and once I grab this Pokestop, I'm going to go ahead and end the video. But again, stay tuned for Wednesday's episode, and the reason why I say that is I've got a secret. I've been thinking about doing it, and uh, because I can't get... Uh, I'm not cheating, guys. You guys know me. I don't bot on this game. I am going to, I th well, I, I, I don't think it's cheating what I have in mind, and I do want you guys to stay tuned for the next episode to find out, because you will, if you don't want to cheat, this is probably a, a way for you to do it, um, the way I'm going to go ahead and announce on Wednesday, but uh, stay tuned, we did not get an egg, and uh, peace out everybody.